Hey guys, this is Sayyid Mohammed Amin from TechisNet. Today I'm going to show you how to add non-Gmail mails in Gmail 5.0. Gmail has launched the all new version of Gmail known as Gmail 5.0 with many features and enhancements. First, go to Play Store and search for Gmail and update your Gmail. From here, after downloading and installing, open it and you can see the all new look. The new version of Gmail is designed based on material concept which looks very colorful and awesome. You can see that it looks very good and gives you a professional feel. This new Gmail is one app for all your emails like Yahoo, Outlook, etc. You can click the menu over here and here then you can add accounts from here you can see that I have a gmail account and I have a yahoo account which is in my gmail you can also add your domain or work mails using exchange support to do this just you need to install the exchange support services and you are good to go now I'm going to show you how to add non gmail emails automatically we have also written a complete article on this you can visit our blog cyber free wishes or techisnet and view our complete article as it is my recent article you can see that it is on the top how to add non gmail mails open it you can find this article later by clicking on the link i have posted on the screen you can read the complete steps on our website we have also added the details regarding your yahoo mail gmail and hotmail like the port number ssl enabled the server of pop3 and imap smtp you can also check it over here i have shown the step on download and install new gmail update it and now i'll show you the steps first click on menu you can click here or you can go from settings click on add account and here it will be and here a window will be prompted showing a google account or other account click on personal imap or pop account and click on ok here type your email address email id now you can see that yahoo provides all the details automatically so i can directly click on next now it will ask for a password enter your password after entering your password click on next it will validate settings and you can see that automatically all the settings have been set up just click on next and the account will be created you can see that you can change the display name etc and click on next you can see my account is created and you can do all the settings in it and use it as a normal account from here also you can see that the account is added and if i click on it all the mails regarding that account will open it is a very good update from gmail and a very major update after a long time now i will show you how to manually do this and add a different account just from here click on add account select as imap or pop account ok write your email address after writing your email address click on manual setup here it will ask for personal pop3 or personal imap click on any one of those i am clicking pop3 now it will ask for password enter your password after entering your password click on next and you can see that incoming server settings your username password server hotmail.com port number you can also see your security type etc and now click on next it will validate your settings and if they are correct it will move on to next step after validating the account will be added
As I have said, you can also add your domain uh, work mails using exchange support. You can see that if I click on add account and select as it will also be as Google account. Click on OK and it is an existing account and type your email and password over here. You can see that it is my techisnet account, I mean dot tech at techisnet.com and now I'll click on next accept the policies now you can see that my account is added as it is my domain account but also it is added with the exchange support thanks for watching our video please subscribe to our youtube channel